hi guys, uh, this is the Catalyst Nation boss. Uh, I hope you know it. <laughs> Today I'm not going to write one of those long articles on Facebook. I just want to keep everything short uh, in this video. And today I'm just going to um, look into the issue of Shatawale and Gamro. Today Shatawale went live um, to address an, uh, a royalties issue with um, Gamro. And according to him, um, he went to Gamro to claim his royalties. And to his surprise, he was told that the royalties were paid, his last royalties were paid to uh, his former management. I'm talking about Boo House Entertainment, the record label owned by Boo Dog himself. And when he investigated, he went to Boo House to claim the money. He was told that the money was paid to one guy called Rafik. Rafik. So he said he went to Rafik to claim the money. And to his surprise again, <laughs> Rafik said he had never received any money from the Ghana Music Rights Organization. So he took the matter to the Legon Police Station to address the issue. He went there to write a statement. Rafik too went to write a statement and still denied that he has not received any money from Gambo. But the issue is who is telling the truth here and who is lying? He claimed he went back to Gambo to ask them who they really paid the money to, but Gamro insisted that the money was paid to the guy called Rafik because Rafik's contact was on um, Shatawale's record. So the money was directed to his mobile money account. Now, Gamro said they've paid the money to Rafik via mobile money. Shatawale went there, he asked, they are not giving him the money. So, who is telling the truth here and who is lying here? Now let's just go to the straight, the point straight and just cut matter short. If you've really sent money, if Gamro believed they've really sent his royalties to Raf, that Rafi guy, what shows, what is the proof that the money was sent to Rafi? Don't they have any record? When you send mobile money to someone, don't they have any record that will show? We all know that when you send mobile money to someone, when you send mobile money to someone, we all know that you will receive a confirmation test, and that is your receipt. So you will know that, oh, okay, this is it. So you save it somewhere. Or you see that Gamro do not have records. They deleted all their records. They don't have any records at all. When you paid royalties to someone, can't you keep the records? Can't you tell us the dates when you sent the money or what? And Shatawala should have even asked them, what's the record? If you really pay the guy the money to Rafik, what shows that you've paid the money? It's not just by math. Show me a receipt. Because I know that any payment they make, they have receipt. So where is the receipt? Who is lying to us here? Shatawale should have even gone straight. I will even blame Shatawale. You should ask them. Don't even come and sit on Facebook and do live video. Just ask them straight. My guy, if you send them the money, if you send the Rafi guy the money, where is the receipt? What shows that you truly pay the money to this guy? I think someone is lying somewhere. I don't know. I'm not going to say Gamro is lying, Shatawale is lying, or it is Rafi. But I think someone is lying. Someone is not telling us the truth. That's all I have to say. Thank you.